switch as you see you have a hole in the middle you got to take off the steering wheel the airbag so this would also be a video on how to take off your airbag how to change your clock spring all right so you're gonna want this right here something like this a screwdriver well, this is what i got something flat because on the side right here where this hole is there's a pin inside i don't know if you can see it in there but there's a pin in there you gotta push on it but i'm going to show you how to do that in a few all right all right we get one to release you want to turn it and find another one Got two more to release. And I mean, one more to release. The horn gonna go off. What, you falling asleep on the wheel? Is that what it is? <laughs> What's up, mama? What's up? It's time to find the song. It's a little tricky sometimes, but there we go. All right, so that's it. I'm gonna show you how we do it in a few. All right, like that, go to the other side, like that, push this one up. like that. Also. Go ahead and lift the horn switch up. I mean the plug for the horn switch. Alright. So we can go ahead and remove this from here also. So you want to unclip it from on this side. Over here. Alright. That's how you do that. I know it's a little shaky because I have to keep my phone in my hand recording it. So, um, this is the, st the, the thing you want to look for right here. Right here, alright? So, what it do, it lock in here. It lock in here. So, when you look through the little holes in the side, you will see it right here. And you want to get this right here and push it push it in like that all right when you push it in the spring gonna push it so you're gonna pop pop out all right so that's how you remove that um you want to remove this right here now hold the um the steering and that's gonna be 21 millimeter so now get that off and it will come off all right easy as that take your time pull this out and also this you want this to stay center at all time all right don't let it spin around or spin because you can break the clock spring, all right? And you can pull on this down here too. And that will come out, all right? Not there for now. So now you're gonna need a Phillips screwdriver. You have one right here, one right here, and one at the bottom right here. All right, so I'm gonna show you that in a few. Take that one off. All right, say you can move it. All right. Got one down here. Take that off. that one off and that's it that's how you take it off so you have one you have one right here one right here 
and one right here, all right? And take it out. All right, that's out. Now this plug right here. You want to squeeze here, take that one out. This right here, you got to pull this back right here and then take it out. All right, so this right here. Pull it back like this, all right? Spring tension. So now, what you want to do is... What you want to do is get it to focus. Let's see this right here. All right, I'm trying to pull back up. Pull back a little bit. We have the other one right here. Finger on it. Pull down. Pull back a little. And the same thing for right here. Pull down. Pull back a little. And then this will come off like this, all right? Remember, keep this in a safe location and don't let it turn. So now it's time to take this off right here, all right? You have one Phillips screw right here. And another Phillips screw down there, all right? All right, so now it's free. Time to remove this right here. Hopefully this fit. Nope, gotta get it with a screwdriver. All right. Um, that's off you just pull on it all right just just rack it around and pull on it over put it right there lift up over there push push basically you just push this down right here all right so you want to get rid of the old one get the new one install it in the new one snapped in all right lock into place I'm installing the plug for the wiper um for the headlamp switch and now it's the plug for the wiper wiper switch all right Alright, that's in. Now it's time to catch the, the screws in here. There's one right here. And we have another one right here. Now it's time to get your airbag clock spring. Lock that into place. Go ahead and plug it in also. Alright, that's good. Now you want to go ahead and put on your cover, steering column cover. That's all in. All right. Now remember, one is underneath right here. good now it's time to put the top one on oh. all right the 
that's good. Mark, if you're supposed to mark, it's best to mark it before you take it off. But because I do so much of this, I don't need to mark it. All right, because it goes in different, different directions and stuff. This right here. All right. Get a screw. That's good right there. Then you want to make sure you double check this and torque it to the correct spec. All right. It's time to install your airbag. Then yellow with yellow. And blue with blue. Alright, so that's a lock in and then you wanna take your arm wire for your arm switch. Connect it right here. So yellow, yellow, blue, blue, and your own switch. All right. And flip it over. Make sure all the wires stuck inside. Line it up, glue it the hole. And that's it. All right. And then you want to go ahead and put the key in it. Make sure the, the light work and everything works so see you next time guys thank you for supporting me i'm at 190 something subscriber thank you guys and i keep i hope i keep going up more and more all right thank you guys thanks for the love and support